Hey guys, it's Friday again and I'm relaxing after a long week and uh, I thought I'd make a video. Uh, November was just a really, really good month for pickups for me and this was, you know, I already showed you the Xbox I got with all the games and stuff, but uh, before that I actually made a garage sale find and um, that is this little N64. I got it at... Uh, this like lady was selling all this stuff and I didn't see any games around uh, what she was selling she was mostly just selling furniture but I asked hey uh, you know are you, do you maybe have any old video games for sale because she kind of looked like she was a mom you know maybe she had some kids at some point and uh, she's like oh actually yeah uh, I hadn't brought them out yet but let me go grab the box so I'm like oh okay and uh, she came out and she had a, a PlayStation 2 in this box which I wasn't really interested in because I've already got a few of those. But this N64, she also had. And um, I've never owned an N64 in my life. Uh, and I was trying to think back after I bought this, like, why did I just never pick up that system when I was younger? You know, I, I had the NES, which I loved. I had the Super Nintendo, which I loved even more. But, um... You know, around that time where the 3D Gen was coming out, for some reason I remember Nintendo 64 just being almost off my radar completely. And I was trying to think back why, you know, what, you know, why, why wasn't I interested in, in a new Nintendo? And then I looked at like the dates when these things came out, and I saw uh, the N64 came out I think in '96 or maybe '95, but. Uh, the PlayStation had actually come out almost a year before it. And I said, oh, okay, that's why. That's why I never got this Nintendo, because I probably already was looking at PlayStation stuff. So, um, you know, I, I really never knew that much about N64. I, I had a, one college friend that had one of these things, and he'd always be playing the, uh, the uh, WWF wrestling games where you got like four players going together. He loved those games, and uh, I watched him play a couple times and never joined in. The, the graphics just looked awful to me. I'm like, man, why would you want to play this? <laughs> I just kept, you know, paying attention to PlayStation. But um, I thought, you know, since I saw this thing at a garage sale, uh, she was asking $50 for everything. And uh, I just grabbed, grabbed all the stuff she had, and she was happy to get my 50 bucks, and I was happy to get a new system. And it was actually really clean too. Uh, she said it was like her daughter's. And uh, you know, it's like the original gray unit. It's not one of the fancy colors or anything. But it's in really good shape. I got um, the system. I got Banjo-Kazooie, you can see in there. I got a bunch of controllers. We got like the regular gray one. We got some kind of aftermarket Super Pad 64 Plus. Got another aftermarket one. Another Super Pad 64. And we got an official gray one that's been chewed up by a dog. I don't know if you can see that there. <laughs> I'll probably just throw this one away. And then we got a uh, cool little purple one. And none of these are really... Um, the, the purple one and the, and the black one are in really nice shape. They barely look like they've been played with at all. So I usually just use those when I'm trying it. And I got a little, you know, memory card for it too here. That's so weird plugging the memory card in the in the controller like that. And uh, she also had some games for it. So I got a uh, 007 GoldenEye, which I've heard is a wonderful game. Um, I'll, we'll get to my opinions on that in a second. <laughs> we got another 007 game, The World Is Not Enough, a little blue cartridge. We got Tony Hawk's Pro Skater, and uh, I love Pro Skater on the PlayStation. Um, I never had the first one, though. I just played the second one. And I played that one a bit. That, that's, that one's not bad, actually. It's pretty fun. We got Pokemon Snap, which I have not tried yet. We got Mario Kart 64, which I have played uh, some time in, too. I gotta say, though, like... These N64 games really are just not that impressive to me. And I can maybe see like why I just 
never really, um, you know, paid attention to it back when it came out. And this game I actually uh, bought on eBay. This is the only thing I didn't get at the garage sale. And that is Ridge Racer 64, because I thought I'd try it out. And uh, I was pretty disappointed with this one, too. <laughs> I mean, the, the controls aren't really terrible. I mean, I'm, I'm used to playing old Ridge Racer games, so I'm, I'm used to the controls. And they're, they're pretty spot on, even for this one. But the graphics, I mean, I mean, you look at the PlayStation um, graphics, you know, and they do look really dated, but at least they're clear, you know, like all the pixels are clear and the picture looks, you know, as nice as it could. And, um, you know, this N64, I, I think uh, probably the reason it just didn't do very well is because the graphics on it. Um, you know, and, and I, will, I know there's a lot of diehard N64 fans. I'm not trying to insult you guys. But this system, I, I don't know what Nintendo was thinking, to be honest. It, the anti-aliasing effects they have on just all the games. I mean, the, I, know, I know they're like the first 3D generation, so you don't want to like complain too much. But, I mean, compared to the PlayStation, the, the graphics have just looked terrible, uh, to me anyway. And, um, I mean, that's kind of sad because I think Nintendo, you know, they could have done a lot better than this. And, um, I looked, I looked online, I think they only have like 300 games for the system, you know, some, somewhere around that figure. And, uh, you know, PlayStation has, what, 2,000 or something? I mean, they, they just wiped the floor with Nintendo back then. And, um, uh... So I mean, I I guess I got my fifty dollars worth, <laughs> but I've, I've seen these these things on eBay go for a lot more, and I think I think the reason for that is because this is what I'd say is a nostalgia system. You know, I'm like maybe if I hadn't gotten a PlayStation, if I had just you know waited and gotten this thing instead, I I'd, I'd be very happy playing you know Mario 3D, and I'd think wow, this is the greatest thing in the world. And even like the best game on the system, the Ocarina of Time, everyone says it's the best Zelda on the system. I look at that game, I'm like, wow, that's ugly. It looks really ugly. <laughs> and, um, you know, I mean, maybe if I played it back in the day, I'd, I'd have a little little better opinion of it. Because that's, that's how nostalgia works. But, you know, I could, I've played these older systems, you know, back where... I, something I have no nostalgia with, like maybe, maybe just like a, a Super Nintendo game that I never even heard of. You know, I have no nostalgia for that Super Nintendo game, but I can still play it, and it still looks like impressive to me, even though I have no nostalgia for it. This game, these games, I mean, even the ones that are supposed to be really good, like GoldenEye and Mario Kart. I mean, I would rather play Mario Kart on the Super Nintendo than on this N sixty four because. I mean, the gameplay is okay. The gameplay is fine, I guess. But the, the graphics are just so muddy and ugly looking. Um, I don't know, man. I just can't really do it. I'm going to try to, you know, give it some time and, and maybe it'll grow on me. But, I don't know. I just thought, <laughs> I just thought I'd come in here and rant about this a little bit. But anyways, um, yeah, I I, it, was, it was a good deal fine anyway. I, I couldn't get some solace out of that anyway but uh that's it for today folks and um i'm gonna make another video soon hopefully i got a new camera here i don't know if you can tell but um my, my wife bought me a new uh cell phone for my birthday so i've got the new new samsung here i don't know if the video is going to be any better and uh i also got a video editing program actually like two years ago and i never played with it all but Recently, I've been playing it a little bit more, so I'm going to try to maybe get a little, uh, you know, gameplay footage and stuff in the next video for you guys. But that's it for today. Hope you have a good one, and uh, see you next time. Bye-bye.